Someone asked me recently what awards I have won or earned in my life, and I had to think about it. It was obviously a, a total blank there for a while. Um, I do know that back when I was in elementary school, I won an award called King of the Week from Vacation Bible School. Um, it was made of high quality uh, plastic, so um, needless to say, I don't have that anymore. But as I looked around my study, I did realize that there is a plaque, there's an award that I won, and it is this one right here. This is the uh, Coach of the Year for U8 Soccer in Coweta County, Georgia. Uh, now you may wonder, Bob, is, it's not appropriate really, is it, for you to boast about the awards you've received? Well. Uh, this award may seem insignificant, but it was when I was able to coach my son, Taylor, in U8 soccer. And if you're not aware of what that is, that is anybody under the age of eight. And so the quality of soccer uh, and the players isn't all that high. But it was a fun award. And as I looked at it and I recalled the memories of coaching my son and some other players and some good memories. And next to this award is the picture of that little team and a whole lot younger coach. Now, um, as I reflected on it though, so often we get caught up in the awards that we win here on earth and usually uh, they are things that we like to boast about because they are things that we earned. But you know, the greatest award that has ever been given to me is the, is the salvation that's been given to me in Christ Jesus. Through faith in Jesus Christ, I have been awarded eternal salvation. Through faith in Jesus Christ, I have been awarded the privilege of being a son of God, co-heir with Jesus. The privilege is immense, and that award is one that I have already received, but the, I will fully receive it when I get to heaven. So what's great about it is this, is so often as we go through life, um, we get discouraged because we don't have a lot of plaques. And I, I point this out, pointing my Coweta County Coach of the Year award, is simply because it's very small to many peers that I know and friends that I know. It's very insignificant. And so it's so easy to get discouraged when you go like, I never earned those awards. I wasn't the smartest student in class. I didn't excel. I didn't make the most sales in my job. But as believers in Jesus Christ, all of us have been given an award that is far greater than anything that we can receive in heaven. And it's an award that never fades. It doesn't fail. It's saved for us in heaven. I don't know about you, but that is really, really good news. I'm Bob Warner, and I'd like you to think about that.